Are you searching for fun ways to entertain your dog and keep them mentally stimulated? If so, you should probably consider adding brain games to their routine. Brain games improve your pup's life by giving them meaningful things to do. And because these activities reduce boredom, they can also reduce the chances of your pup developing behavioral issues such as excessive chewing or barking. If you're in need of some easy ways to challenge your dog's mind and keep them out of trouble, here are 10 fun brain games for dogs. Before we get into this, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more doggy tips and best practices. Leave a comment down below saying I subscribe and we'll try our best to personally respond to your comments. Just a heads up, this video contains affiliate links which means that if you click on one of the product links, we'll receive a small commission which does help our channel. We know you can't wait, here are 10 brain game ideas for your pup. Number 1. Get your dog involved in a treasure hunt. Getting your dog to use his nose to find hidden treasure is a great way to stimulate his brain and teach him to use all his senses. Starting out, you'll want to set your dog up for success so he understands the game and doesn't get too discouraged. Begin with something simple. Put your dog in a sit, stay, and hide a treat or favorite toy somewhere obvious, even letting him watch you hide it. Then give him the release cue to go find the toy. Reward your dog big time for his success in finding the hidden treasure. Once your dog understands the game, ramp up the difficulty. Hide the treat or toy in another room or someplace where other scents mask the treat or toy, like the bottom of the laundry bin or under the food dish. Let your dog investigate and provide the reward once he finds the toy or treat. Number 2. Play hide and seek with your dog. Hide and seek is a great game and is one of the whole family can play. Start by hiding somewhere in the house where your dog can't see you. Then call your dog. When they find you, make sure to give them verbal praise and a nice treat. If you have other family members, have them hide elsewhere in the house and call your dog to them. Repeat for as long as your dog is maintaining interest. This is a great game to help work on your dog's recall for a different version of hide and seek. You may also want to try out this outward hound hide a squirrel dog toy. You hide the plush squirrels in the trunk and your dog is challenged to nuzzle them out. The squirrels have hidden squeakers for added fun. Your pup might just have a new favorite toy. You can find this in the description. Number 3. Teach your dog the names of their toys. Another fun brain game for dogs is the name game and the best way to do it is by using your dog's toys. Do you already have names for your dog's toys? If so, you're already ahead of the curve. Start by playing with your dog in one specific toy giving it a name while you do. After some practice and praise, your dog will assign that verbal name with the chosen toy. Once your dog has learned that specific toy's name, you can test their skills by seeing if they can pick it out among their other toys. After your dog knows the name of one toy, you can move on teaching them the name of another. On average, dogs can learn 165 different words, so your dog has the potential to learn the names of a lot of different toys. Chaser the Border Collie, an extraordinary example, knows the names of a thousand plus toys. Before we go into more brain games, we want to point out that training your dog is an essential part of setting him up for mental and behavioral success. To help you with this, you may want to check out the Brain Training for Dogs course, generated from well-established scientific ideas researched heavily at Harvard. This online course teaches you how to engage your dog on a mental level by using simple brain games and techniques to develop their intelligence. You'll be amazed at how quickly problem behaviors disappear and your dog starts to obey you. If you're interested in finding out more information, you could check out the link in the description. Number 4. Teach your dog to put their toys away. Now that your dog has learned the names of a few of her toys, it's time to teach her how to put them back into the toy box and keep everything tidy. Teaching your dog new skills boosts their confidence and it's a great way to give them more mental stimulation. To get your dog understanding the game, you'll want to start with the drop it command. Getting your dog to drop a toy on command is a key component to getting him to the next step of dropping it in a particular location. After your dog has a solid understanding of this command, have them pick up a toy and give them their drop it command once they're standing over their toy box or container. After this part is mastered, build up to the number of toys your dog picks up. Start with rewarding your dog each time he puts a toy away. 
then reward him only after he puts away two toys, then only after three toys, and so on. Eventually, the reward will only come when every toy is put away, and you'll have a dog running around the room finding every toy as quickly as he can in order to win that wonderful jackpot reward of a handful of treats. Number five, play food puzzle games with your dog. Working for food appeals to most dogs. Sure, they may prefer that you just dump their dinner in the bowl, but making an effort to find and release food from its hiding place in a food puzzle sharpens up their problem-solving skills while activating ancestral hunting instincts. Trixie Dog Puzzle Game is a fun and challenging flip board puzzle that will offer plenty of mental stimulation and keep your pup occupied while working on getting to his treats. This chess board game includes cones, drawers, and small hollows to hide treats in. This can really help dogs with destructive tendencies to channel their energy more positively. Cheers to your dog having fun! You can find this in the description below. If you like what you see so far, subscribe and give us a like. Hit the notification bell so you're notified anytime we upload. Number 6. Play the Shell Game with your dog Despite its dubious connection to tricksters, the shell game is a game that can challenge your dog's mind in a positive way. To play the shell game with your dog, you can use three walnut shells, bottle caps, or identical small cups and delicious treats broken into bite-sized bits that will fit under the shells. You want a table or flat surface at your dog's nose level. Get your dog's undivided attention and as he watches carefully, line up the shells in a straight row. Grab a treat bit and hold it up to show him. Lift one of the shells then place the treat beneath it. Move slowly and deliberately in a dramatic way to pique his curiosity. Now start shuffling the shells around and you'll notice he's following the one with the treat with his eyes. When you stop your shuffle let your dog guess which shell has the treat. Lift the shell and if he's right he gets the treat. If not the game starts over again. Number 7. Teach your dog new tricks. An activity that boosts your dog's creativity is the new trick game. It's a popular game in clicker training because it teaches a dog to think independently, coming up with his own ideas about what behavior earns a reward. The premise is simple. Click and treat for a new behavior offered by your dog and ignore a behavior already offered. A typical game between a dog and dog parent looks like this. The parent says, new trick, and the dog sits. Parent clicks and treat then says new trick again. The dog lies down, click and treat. Parent says new trick and dog stands and turns in a circle, click and treat. If the dog repeats an action, the parent will tell him you already did that and not offer a reward. He then has to come up with something new and is rewarded after he does that. Once your dog gets the grasp of the game, expand it to other behaviors like sit, down, crawl, spin, sit up, and so on. Pretty soon, your dog will be going through your entire repertoire of tricks and coming up with new ones just to earn that treat for creative thinking. Number 8. Play tricks on your dog with your hands. This exercise is so simple, but it gets your dog thinking. To play this, stand in front of a table or counter and place three treats behind you where your dog won't see them. Call your dog over and ask her to sit in front of you. Hold both your hands palm side in front of her face and ask, where are the treats? Then reach behind with both hands and grab a treat in each hand. Now bring your hands back in front of her this time with both your hands clenched and ask where the treat is. It doesn't matter which hand she chooses because she gets the treat either way. Repeat a couple of times until she's used to getting a treat. Then start putting only one treat in your hand. Keep switching around the routine and watch her face light up with delight when she gets it right. Number 9. Use food dispensing toys. Another fun brain game for dogs is using food dispensing toys. A food dispensing toy is any toy that contains food and requires your dog to work to figure out how to obtain the food. To use a food dispensing toy, you simply fill it up with treats and encourage your dog to engage with it. As your dog starts moving the toy around, it'll start dispensing treats. Our favorite food dispensing toy is our pet's IQ treat ball that can keep your dog mentally stimulated for an extended period of time. This interactive treat dispensing toy is available in 3 and 4 inch sizes and you can adjust the level of difficulty as your dog learns how to get treats faster. You can also find this in the description. 
Number 10. Train your dog using an obstacle course. Training your dog to go through an obstacle course is a great mental workout. This can be a DIY dog brain game where you arrange some chairs, tables, blankets, toys, and create your own obstacle course. Or if you want to go all out, you could purchase some agility equipment for your yard. The Outward Hound obstacle course that you see on your screen is an affordable option that includes an adjustable jump, weaving poles, and a tunnel. It's a very fun activity for your pup. You can find it in the description. Brain games are a great way to keep your dog well trained and mentally stimulated. The trick is to stay patient and consistent so your dog becomes acquainted with the games. Once your dog is familiar with brain games, you'll want to establish a routine for your pup. If you leave the dog to come up with his own, you're not going to like the biting, potty accidents, and bad behaviors that may result from an inconsistent schedule. So if you're ready to learn tips on how to establish the best routine for your puppy, check out this video. Make sure to watch till the end where we provide you with a daily sample schedule. If you're new to our channel and you like it, leave us a comment and please subscribe.